Under My Roof lets you create virtual scans of the rooms in your home using Apple's Room Plan technology. To start a scan, tap and hold on the location you wish to scan and select View to bring up its detail view, and then switch to the Photo section. Tap the Add button and select From Room Scan. Work your way around the room, making sure to capture the bottom and top of each wall. The scanner will prompt you if you need to make any adjustments. For the best results, the room should be well lit. Open the window curtains to allow a natural light if possible. The scanner can detect larger objects in the room, such as sofas, tables, and beds. Making sure you get these objects fully in frame improves recognition and size detection, as does making sure the doors in the room are closed. You can view and interact with the scan room and under my roof from any device, but scanning requires a LiDAR-equipped iPhone or iPad, running iOS or iPadOS 17 or later. Tap the Done button once you've completed your scan. Room scans appear in the photo section of a location's detail view. By default, the room is shown in 2D mode, which presents an overhead view of the room. Tap or click the 3D button to toggle on 3D mode, which shows you a full 3D representation of the room. Beyond showing you the layout of a room, you can get dimensions and areas from parts of the room and even take your own virtual measurements within the room. Tapping or clicking on any part of the room, such as the floor or a wall, or any object in the room will give you the estimated measurements. To take your own virtual measurements, tap or click the target button to toggle measuring mode on. On the iPhone and iPad, tap and hold your finger on the screen at the location you wish to begin the measurement. On the Mac, press and hold the mouse button. As you drag your finger or mouse cursor, the target view in the upper left corner shows a zoomed in view for more precise placement. Lift your finger or release the mouse button to set the end point of the measurement. You can create as many measurements as you want, and if you make a mistake, use the undo button to remove the last measurement. When you are done, tap or click the target button again to exit measure mode. Tap or click the edit button if you need to edit the endpoints of any measurement. On the iPhone and iPad, you can use your finger to drag the endpoint of a measurement to another location. On the Mac, click on an endpoint and while still holding down the mouse button, drag it to where you want it and release the mouse button. To save, print, or share a room scan, tap or click the Photo Options button in the upper left corner. This will create an image of the room scan as it is currently displayed, including any measurements. The accuracy of these measurements depends on the quality of the scan and should be used only as estimates. When exact measurements are required, such as buying new window blinds or replacing a door, you should take those measurements manually.